There it is. Chrono. Oh, there's our guy. There's Chrono. All right. I think I'm going to leave his name Chrono. Up to five characters. Wow. That's an insane limit. All right. Here's our world. All right. This is high resolution. So does this look odd to anybody or is this, is this okay? Because it looks fine to me, but I don't know by comparison. Chrono. Chrono? Chrono, are you still sleeping? It looks fine. Cool, cool, cool. <gasps> Ooh, my mother. Okay. Come on, sleepyhead. It's time to get up. <gasps> Animal? Is it a cat or a dog? <laughs> Dear me, I'd forgotten how beautiful Lean's bell sounds. It's a cat. <laughs> it, could, it could be, or like a fox. It could be a fox. You must have been so excited about the Millennial Fair that you couldn't sleep last night, could you? Well, you'd better not let that giddiness get you into any trouble. I want you to behave yourself today. Let's go. Come on now, out of bed with you. All right, look at it. Look at our leading man. Yes. <laughs> oh, he's got a typewriter. He's got a model ship. He's got a lamp and a book and a radio? <laughs> and an empty pot. I'm trying to interact with everything. Now you can't walk into the beds like in Final Fantasy VI. Look, I'm Chrono. Also, like, wait, his hair flops a little bit when you walk. The cat is wiggling his little butt at me. <laughs> it's about time. By the way, you're going to go see, oh dear, what was her name? That young adventurous friend of yours? Oh, <gasps> Luca! It's pronounced Luca, right? It's not like Lucha or something. <laughs> All right, we're, we won't be renaming. We'll just go with Luca. That's right, Luca. You're gonna stop? Wait, that's right, Luca. <laughs> What's the cat's name, though? You're gonna stop by and see her new invention at the fair, aren't you? Uh, well, run along then and be back before dinner. <laughs> Bob Marl. <laughs> Have we confirmed it's even a cat? I'm gonna go with fox. If it's never told in the game that it's a cat, I really think it's a fox. <gasps> you follow me. Okay, you're looking more cat-like now. Is this spaghetti? Okay, can I take this plant and put it in my pot upstairs? Oh, I almost forgot. Here's your allowance, dear. Money, have fun at the fair. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, we have the whole world ahead of us. I think I'm supposed to go to the fair. 1000 AD. Oh. What in the world is the idol? Oh, is it jump rope? Oh, you're crying. He okay, it's not jump rope. But he is kind of wearing like a jazzercise outfit. Alright, I think I'm supposed to go to the fair. Can I go to this fountain? Mayor's Manor. Oh, everyone's doing jazzercise here. Hello, is this your first visit? Would you like me to tell you about this house? Yes, I would. Our mayor has a soft spot for adventures. He has established this manor as a library of adventuring know-how. Oh, look at the kid running back and forth. <laughs> the contents of the chests in this house were placed by him for adventurers to use. Ah, I am going to reference Final Fantasy VI so many times because like, this is like one of the first places you go to in Final Fantasy VI. You can run by use, oh, there's a run? Hold down B if you want to walk. Oh, you auto run, okay. This is the tutorial house, this is perfect. You can switch the run and walk commands, okay. So this is run. All right, B is circle. I can teach you about weapons and armor. A refresher course. Wait, am I a warrior? Weapons come in a variety of flavors, swords, bows, and guns, to name a few. However, that doesn't mean you can just pick and choose. You must be proficient with a weapon to use it. And everyone's proficiencies are different. Ooh, we have proficiencies? Armor is divided into three categories. Helms, body armor, and accessories. You can only equip armor that fits your own body properly. 
The effects of accessories vary greatly, so you'll need to weigh their benefits carefully when deciding which to equip. The higher your accuracy, the more damage you will deal when attacking with a bow or gun. That makes sense. Gun? You have guns? Why can't I open you? Ah, potion! Well, that's good to have. More empty pots. Okay, also, wait. What's on the back of him? So, this there's like a white tail coming out of his, like, neck or maybe the back of his head. What is that? It's his bandana? He has... Wait. Why would his bandana have a white thing? I mean, everyone agrees it's his... his okay, it's his bandana. <laughs> wait. From the side, it looks like a headband. No, it's a headband! The white thing is the headband! It's definitely... Headband. I reject this bandana business. Okay, scattered throughout the world are points where time's memory is deeply rooted. You can record the progress of your adventures at such places. Fraught with danger as they may be. Oh, so it's a save point. What? Does it work? No. Okay, great tutorial. <laughs> Tell me again. That's just a replica, but I recommend you save your progress whenever you find a real one. They tend to show up in dangerous places. All right, so they've got some food on the table too. And maybe like a small fire? <laughs> or really giant french fries. Okay, cool. What about, wait, did, how I talk to the kids? Kids, you can toggle the position of the message window. Oh. Uh, I'm pressing X. X? <gasps> you can! That's good to know. I think. I probably will completely forget that. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're gonna teach me all about, like, jobs or something. Alright, I can teach you about texts. <laughs> the range of effects varies between texts. Some texts affect an area surrounding the target, dealing damage to all enemies in the vicinity. For example, target this little beastie. <gasps> beastie! Wait, is that like canon? Like, are they being cute or are the enemies in this game called beasties? And your attack will hit the neighboring monster as well. <gasps> oh. But if you target the one in the center, you get them both, or all three. These types of texts come in two varieties. Let's take a look at the first one. Wait, so what do I have to, okay, hopeful, what do I have to select to get to the text? This type of tech allows you to, I guess it'll show me, allows you to attack all the enemies located on a straight line, extending from you and passing through your target. I haven't really played a game, like with this. In this case, it would strike three enemies. A tech like this is only, only allows you to hit enemies along the line that connects you and your target. Good. If, you're, if you target the farthest enemy, you can still deal damage to all three. Probably most people skip this tutorial, but select this one and it's all you'll get. A third type of text strikes all enemies along... Okay. It's not telling me like which type does which, it's just being like, there's a type that does this, there's a type that does that. Maybe I don't even have them yet though. All that matters is that your enemies form a line. I'm guessing it doesn't give me the like imaginary football line when I'm actually in the game. As long as they do, targeting any of them will have the same effect. The final pattern puts you at the center of the attack zone. You can't use an attack like this if there are no enemies within range. <gasps> They're surrounding me, but if you find yourself surrounded, using one of these techs will allow you to deal damage to all of the enemies in a circle around you. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Okay, that does... yeah, I think I get that. Shall I teach you the basics of battle commands? In battle, you must make use of the attack, tech, and item. Okay. Okay, I actually think probably I'm good to go on that. It did say something about a cursor. I wonder if it has like a Final Fantasy VII cursor. No, it just means like when I'm in the menu. Okay, that's fine. I do want whatever's in this chest though. He's really picky about where I stand. Want me to share some insight? Ooh, what's your insight on? I can tell you've got potential. You'll learn a number of skills. 
or techs as you fight more battles. Techs are special attacks that utilize your weapons as well as your own innate potential. But mastering them requires repeated practice and training. Keep at it. Want to learn about the types of status ailments? Oh, I actually maybe do. Certain enemy attacks inflict... Okay, because in every game they're different. Oh, <laughs> Sad chrono. Poisoned chrono. Uh, HP gradually decreases. Okay, poison I'm good with. Poison looks like poison. Slow. That? Okay, slow means I've got a gray outline. Lengthens the waiting time between turns. Okay, sleep it looks fairly obvious. Confused, that's good too. Oh, he laughs! How funny! This can be a little tough on friendships. <laughs> Aww. Blind, okay. Yeah, oh, that's... I like, I like their symbols. These are pretty obvious. Lock prevents the use of text. Stop, okay, good. I'm good. These status ailments lower your defense as well. Meaning you'll sustain more damage. Okay, for all of them. Okay. Use a panacea to remove them during... Oh! Okay, so I don't have specific ones for specific ailments. Just one for all. Would you like to hear more? Nah. <laughs> Probably good. <laughs> Hold down LB and RB to escape from battle. He... Okay, that's good to know. <laughs> the game will uh, regret the day it taught me how to escape. He who fights and runs away lives to fight another day. Oh, thank you for the advice. I'll take that to heart. Of course, he who always runs away will never get any stronger, so don't flee from every battle just because you can. Oh, fine. Let me explain the equipment menu too. The number next to the sword icon indicates attack. The number beside the shield icon indicates defense. Defense represents how effectively physical attacks can be resisted. Magic defense, on the other hand, is used to resist magical attacks. If your magic defense is 40, for example, magic damage dealt to you will be reduced by 40%. Stars in place of a number beside any attribute mean that the attribute has reached its highest possible value. Okay, I think we're done with the tutorial. That, I'm, I mean, I got, I got, um, I think a potion and some money out of it. So I think that's good. Thank you, Tutorial House. Okay. Ooh. Lucas House. Wow, there's a lot of books. Okay. Is Luca also a kid like me? Okay, Luca is at the fair. So, ooh, who are you, though? Oh, hello, Chrono. Luca's off at Lean Square with her father, Taban, unveiling her new invention. Great. I know how important it is to explore. I'm just trying to give this game the exploration it deserves. I don't know how long this will last. I'm going to do my best with this, though. Visit our stall in Lean Square. Oh, okay. Residence. It's hard to believe our kingdom has stood for a thousand years now. Our king is the 33rd descendant to the throne of Guardia. It's a miracle he can manage to rule the kingdom when he can't even keep his own daughter in hand. She's probably throwing a fit at the castle this very moment, demanding he let her go to the fair. Wait, so you can't walk through the woods? You can't walk through the trees? How do you get to the castle? Wait, it's really hard to turn left. <laughs> Hold on. I feel like we might get random encounters here. So do I even have equipment right now? I do. Okay, I do. Maddie's in full exp oop! I just walked straight into this mushroom beastie. Okay, attack. Mushrooms. Wait, give me a tech. Nope, I have no techs. They are going without me. I actually have decent HP, though. Ooh, and I kill so well. You like the OG pixel graphics? Mm, okay, maybe I could switch. I think it's... I wonder if I can do it from the menu or if I have to exit the game. I kill so well. Look at me one-shotting. I love it. Ooh, 3 TP, 9x... Okay, ooh, we got some money and a potion? Look at this. 
Oh, here we go. Yes. Yeah, it does look different. This looks... Yeah, we'll go with this. Okay. Cool, we're still still getting them. And they've given me potions, so I am able to heal myself. Okay. We got some gill. Okay, there's more mushroom enemies. Do they... Attack me if I don't come close to them. No. Oh! <laughs> I'm afraid. I'm looking for shiny things. I just want shiny things. Okay. Uh, let's take a potion, though. We have, we have two of them. And we're low on health. Restores 50. How much have I lost? Okay, we won't use it yet, then. All right, let's see if we can go to the castle. Stop right there. Civilians aren't allowed in here, but I came... I fought so many beasties. Why don't you go enjoy the festival like the other kids? Are they... Oh, they're gonna grab me and throw me out. <laughs> All right, well, I guess back through the woods I go. And all the enemies are back. I should look for shiny things. Ooh, actually, what's over here? Mysterious force seals it shut. Okay. Hmm. I guess, like, for me, I didn't really... Ooh. Oh. Bird? I don't think I want to fight with Bird. I don't need to go that way, though, right? You're right. <laughs> bird guard. Ah, wait! Uh... What even are you? Okay, actually, I don't know which way I came from. Maybe I came... I remember mushrooms, so maybe I came from this way. What? What? You just gonna let me walk on by? <gasps> Shiny! Strength capsule! Okay. Wait, why is my MP 8 out of 10? Have I used... Have I used MP for something? They keep giving me potions! This is wonderful. <laughs> and they don't have- they- this game doesn't have random encounters! The monsters- the beasties are all on the map. Which I prefer. Oh, okay. The market looks huge, but it's actually just this Furby on a desk. I think I've been everywhere now. Nope, I've not been to the inn. I've not been to the fair yet. What? What are you doing here then? You'll have to wait a thousand years. Oh wow, it's a millennial fair. Okay, it really is silly I'm taking my time. <laughs> the festivities are in Lean Square, just up north. More tents and stalls than you can shake a stick at. <gasps> Piano! Say, can you spare 10G to buy me a drink? I mean, I am pretty rich. And she's cute. Let me play you a song! This is exactly what I wanted to do. <gasps> I love her song. Oh, I love this! Ooh, who are you? Remember that earthquake we had the other day? What happens if I say no? You're an oblivious one, aren't you? Well, never mind. Oh no, I do remember! I remember! We've been having far too many lately. Hope it's not a sign of something bad about to happen. Oh, okay. Oh! This box has been handed down for generations. Did you somehow manage to open it, you are welcome- Oh, you don't have an ominous- Oh, a mysterious force seals it shut. Okay, I need to remember where all these boxes are. All right, so box in the inn, box in the woods. Lodging, oh, I, I, I live here. <laughs> Why would I need to stay the night? All right, we've got really low health. I don't think we would have to fight at the fair, but all right. Let's go left first. Line up with the bell and press the button when you're ready. Judge your distance carefully. Press A once, then press A once more. Once more? Okay, I guess I gotta press it once to begin with. Wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? 
Okay, line up. What? Am I not lined up? Okay, lined up. Ding! I I'm lined up! <laughs> oh. Oh, I need a running start. Okay, so get, get in the back. From way back here. Mm, I'm gonna get it. Oh, we go farther back. Boom! Oh, we're so close. <gasps> no, I didn't! Okay, put one silver point on your card. Because it makes sense that you would you would want to hit the hammer from where you can't reach that thing. That makes perfect sense. All right, game. Those runners are busy racing, so they won't answer you if you talk to them. I want to talk to you. <gasps> Is my cat in the race? This kingdom's been through some hard times, like the war against the fiend lord 400. I feel like I need to take notes on this game. The war against the fiend lord 400 years ago. You should be thankful things are so peaceful now. What? Oh. Oh. Okay, wait. I do have money. Should I buy things? I feel like this is really inexpensive. So I'm gonna buy one. Ooh, I also want one of these. I also kind of want one of these. But I never use them, so I'm gonna pass on that for now. Cause like, what if there's fair stuff I need to buy? Today is the 1,000th anniversary of our kingdom's foundation. Enjoy the festivities. I surely would if I were your age. Also, the little snarky comment I made about like it being dumb that you have to hit it from the back. I'm just joking around. I'm just having a good time with it. I surely would if I were your age. This is Lean Square. Legend has it that people who hear Lean's bell live happily ever after. Okay, I, ooh, padded. Okay, hold on. Padded vest. Can I even wear this stuff? It would seem that I can. I don't have a lot of money. Should should I go back to the woods and get more money? Um. Hold on. Equip. What did I just get? Padded vest? Yeah, okay. And then what if I buy the other one? It makes me even better? I want it all. I will go back and grind for more money if I need to. <laughs> okay, now we're so defensy. Okay, today is the 1,000th anniversary of our kingdom's foundations. I surely would if I were your age. Okay, yeah, I've already talked to you. I'm just making sure I'm talking to everyone. Look at that balloon! I hear Luca... Leona, <laughs> it's a lucky emblem! I hear Luca and her father have put together another crazy invention. Oh, and who are you? Melchior, the swordsmith, at your service. Might I interest you in one of my fine... Oh, no! Okay. I bought too much defense. <laughs> I thought that might be the only thing I could buy. That's a pricey sword. I don't think it's reasonable to get the the big boy sword, but maybe like the medium the medium boy sword. So, sword man. Who are you? Oh right, you keep telling me that. Where's my sword guy? You must be sword guy. Yes. All right, we won't go for silver sword. We will go for Bronze Blade. Oh, I can equip from there. It's nice, actually, that you can equip from the, like, uh, purchase menu. But I didn't do it. <laughs> Merchant said he'd buy accessories. Oh, buy. Maybe I should sell him this old pendant of mine. Wait. Shh. Are you telling me that, or am I telling you that? I think he's telling me. No, I think I'm telling him. Okay, there's a race underway. There was a big war hundreds of years ago against the Fiend Lord's armies. 400 years ago, actually. My mom said, it, my mom said if we'd lost, we wouldn't be having a fair like this today. Foreshadowing. Oh no. 
I just walked, I just like pushed her. <laughs> I just wanted to talk. Oof. Oh, she's probably not like, she probably doesn't sound like Donkey Kong. Oof. Ouch. Oh, did she just wipe off her butt? I'm so sorry, are you okay? Oh, she, oh, she pushed me. Uh-oh, my pendant. It's not there, it's not there. Oh, she's just looking in two places back and forth for it. But look, look at me, I'm Chrono. I found your pendant. Oh, thank goodness, my pendant. I know it doesn't look like much, but it has a lot of sentimental value. May I have it back? No, <laughs> it's all mine. Thank you. You must live in this town. I came to see the fair. Awfully boring wandering around alone though, isn't it? Uh, awfully boring wandering around alone. Is she hitting on me? Are we gonna wander together? Hey, why don't we, wa why don't we walk around together for a while? Wouldn't that be great? Sure. She's so happy. Yahoo, this will be fun. She's so, what's her name? Oh, I never told you my name, did I? <laughs> It's, a. Uh, uh, she's gonna lie to me. Oh, no, she's not. It's just, I get to choose her name. Marl. It's Marl, and you're... Chrono, what a nice name. Well, pleased to meet you, Chrono. Come on, let's enjoy the fair. Let me see how many silver. I only have one. Would you like to exchange? I don't have that many. <laughs> Alright, I need more silver points. Oh ho ho, there's nothing like a good fair. Have you heard the gossip? No. Well, just between us, I heard that the king is tearing his hair out over this tomboy of a daughter. This is the gossip? Just one. Just, this is the gossip. The king has a tomboy daughter. Just once, I'd like to meet her and see how wild she really is. Preparations are still underway. Enjoy yourself in the square for a while and check back. Okay. Do you say the same thing, sir? Drinking contest, step right up. Press A as fast as you can. All right, ready, set, go. All right, so much drinking. Okay, are we done? When, do, when does it end? Not bad, I'll put five silver points on your card. Cool. You're awfully competitive, aren't you, Chrono? What did, did she just, what? <laughs> Where did she leap? <laughs> All right, now Chrono's gonna have to go to the bathroom for the entirety of his date. <sighs> uh, my kitty ran away. She's in the race. Oh, well, I guess I'm doing the drinking contest again. <laughs> I really want those points. <laughs> Yarrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
My dear old wife made that lunch for me. Always the highlight of my day. Gives me that extra oomph when I'm starting to feel worn down. Cat! Can I... Where did the cat go? Cat? Kitty! I'm not sure where the cat went, but the little girl's missing you. Scared him away, oh no! Go straight ahead if you want to try your hand against Luca's biped bipedal robot battler, Gatto. You can win silver points if you beat him. Alright, uh, they call me Gatto. I have metal joints. If you can beat me up, you'll earn 15 points. Alright, let's beat him up. <gasps> oh, it's a fight! Tech. Let's use Cyclone. Nice. What are you doing to me? Not bad, not bad. Okay, attack. Do I control her? Hold on. I think I maybe just attacked her. That's fine. Or atta attacked with her. I didn't attack her. Cool. So actually, that was better than my Cyclone. Wait, did we do it? I think so. Oh no, I have lost and it seems you've won. Here are your 15 points now. Wasn't that fun? Ah, I got a crit. Cool. Oh, uh, yeah, the sound effects are fun. Plus I got two, no, 15 points, I think. Okay, cat. I would like to somehow convince you. Nah, <laughs> come back. Dang it. I thought maybe I could just like pick her up from behind. All right, so I must not have done all that there is to do. What am I missing? I do have some more points now. Has the race finished? No. Okay, we'll do one more of these. Oh, I think I only get one point for this. So maybe I shouldn't. Yeah, okay, never mind. <laughs> Kingdom's been through some hard times, like the war against the 400 years ago. That's how I knew. Uh... Oh, I could buy more things if I wanted to. Nope, never mind. I only have 71G. Oh, I could buy things for her now. But I... Oh, okay. Actually, I did get the tip that I can sell stuff. So, like... Probably don't need this. Or this. Or this. Hopefully that's fine. I haven't saved. So it's done now. Oh, Luca's device is all set up now, you know? Just go straight to the back of the square. Oh no, I need to save the cat! How do I save the cat? Okay, so. Oh, I bet I have to walk. Do I just have to walk up to it? Nope, it didn't work. That's not where you are. Just a minute, I want to get some candy. Wait, give me a second to choose. Oh, okay. Excuse me, I'd like one of these. Sure, young miss. Thanks for waiting. Oh, okay. This is candy? I'll go back and try again. So, I'm gonna walk. I tried to pet you. You didn't want me to. How far away do I have to go? So it's not walking, but I will walk up to you. Um, I don't really have that many actions that I can do. I want to get behind you. There's the meow. Oh, you're following me. Okay. Are you still following me? Are you bugged? <laughs> there we go. Don't run at all. Okay. Are you still here? 
No, wait, where, where was the person who lost the cat? I thought you were in this one. There's the girl with the cat. Let's give her her cat. All right. Cool, kitty's coming. Kitty around the corner, kitty up the stairs. And look, look, look. Okay, how do I give it to you without you getting scared? Yay, you brought back my kitty, thank you. Chrono, you're so sweet. Oh, and the cat immediately runs away again. Okay, so I impressed Marl. Marl likes us now, yay. Step right on up. Any with the time and courage, our first ever hyperdimensional transporter is the invention of the century. Simply hop up here, and you'll be teleported here. This fantastic machine is the masterwork of my beautiful and brilliant daughter, Luca. Where is she? Oh, she's right there. Oh, okay. <laughs> what does teleport mean? <laughs> Kid's not impressed. Luca invented this thing? Wonder what'll go wrong this time. This contraption is supposed to transport objects in the blink of an eye. Chrono. I was wondering when you'd show up. No one wants to try my telepod. Would you be so kind? Oh, she's... She jumps around and she's so excited. Oh, this will be fun. I'll watch while you try it out. Just hop up onto the left pod. Okay, left pod. Send me on my way. System activated. Initiating energy transfer. Let's go. Oh, we did it. We became Chrono again before all the sparklies came over. Ooh, amazing. This is how the fly got started. We did it. Good job, Luca. How is not, like, wait, how is everyone not insanely impressed that I just teleported from one place to another? So how was it? Want to try again? It, it works! Unbelievable! They never... <laughs> As I was saying, Luca has done it again, ladies and gentlemen! A thrilling display of science at its best. Wow! I suppose even Luca's inventions are bound to work sometimes. <laughs> she just did something insane and incredible, and they're just like, well, a broken clock's twice right, or whatever the phrase is. Right twice a day. The shade, such shade. So how was it? Want to try again? I guess we're trying again. Give it, ch give it a chance to fail. I think is what we're doing. System activated. Initiating energy transfer. Okay, I'm gonna because of the law of threes, we're gonna do it again and see if anything changes, and then we're gonna leave. Nope, we did it three times in a row, and it's still amazing. Okay. Uh, oh, did I talk to you yet? That looks like fun. I want to try it too. Huh? Chrono, when did you manage to pick up a cutie like her? Oh, she's not jealous. That's wonderful. It's all right, isn't it, Chrono? Just wait right here. Don't run off on me. Just, just leave her in the telepod and run away. That's what we should do. Behold, ladies and gentlemen, as this vision of loveliness steps aboard the machine. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back. You're sure about this? There's still time to change your mind. No way, I'm not afraid. Okay, everyone, let's give her a great big hand when she teleports from the platform. Oh, here we go. Initiating energy transfer. Uh-oh, the music. What's happening? My pendant, it's, oh, the pendant. Huh? Uh-oh! Oh, the pendant! Uh, okay. 
into the portal, but the pendant doesn't go. Oh! Marl! Oh no! Got a bad feeling about this, yeah. Luca, she's not reappearing. Well, all right, as you can see, the girl has vanished before your very eyes. Show's over, folks, move along. That's what we meant to do. What just happened, Luca? Where is she? Luca just leaves. The way she disappeared. That couldn't have been the telepod. <gasps> Interference, intercepted. The way that rift appeared and the way her pendant seemed to be reacting to it. Something else must have caused it all. Well, what are we supposed to do now? Is there any way we can help her? That girl's face was so familiar. You know I've seen her somewhere. <gasps> pendant. Chrono! Oh, you're going after her? What a fine lad. It's the only way. I don't know where that hole leads, but we've got no other choice. Wow, you're just so easily just sending your friend into this hole? Let's just hope it opens up again. Well, it's worth a shot. The pendant seems to be the key, so hang on to it. Chrono, embrace yourself. Luca, why don't you go into the hole? System activated. Initiating energy transfer. Boost the power output. Roger. Here we go. Into hole. More! I need more power! Roger. There. The music, too. I think we did it. Here we go. Into hole. Oh, the pendant's coming this time? Good luck, Chrono. I'll follow you as soon as I figure out what went wrong. Is it the pendant? Uh-oh. Beasties. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't really need- wait, okay, wait. Uh, whirl about enemies striking others nearby. They're not near each other, so I'm just gonna attack one at a time. I'm still taking them out in one- one attack, so that's great. I will need to heal, though. It's question marks, okay. Alright, let's... where's... let's use one. Yeah, we'll be safe. We seem to get a lot of them from fights. Okay, I'm gonna explore. It is nice having the beasties on screen. Which way do I want to go? Okay, so there's some guy, some beastie, just kicking around some roly-poly. Alright, we've got- oh! Birds dropping off the beasties. Uh, okay, hold on. Let's try a cyclone. Yeah, okay, this is an AoE. That's how you do it. That's much better. Perfect. I mean, I am gonna fight you, but I'm looking around first. Wait, is that the chest I just opened? Why does it look like it's closed? I do investigate. Power glove. Oh, it's a power glove. Where does it go? Power glove? So speed goes down, but those go up. That's fine. Uh, wait. Tech? Yeah, let's do it. It's a movie reference. Oh, the power glove? Okay, I keep getting TP. What? Okay. I would think it's tech points, but tech... Techs use MP, seem to anyway, yeah. And I don't know how to get MP back without using uh, a shelter, which I don't have because I didn't buy one. Hmm, okay. Maybe I should stop using my techs. <gasps> oh dear. Oh no. Okay. Well, either it's just windy, or bad things are happening. Well, this is different. It's dark. 
10G, okay. Yeah, we can we can afford a 10G room and that'll get our MP back. This box has been handed down for generations. Still, it's mysterious. So the box is still here. Where are you, you say? He's some sort of simpleton? <gasps> Even a half-wit would know this is this land for Guardia. Our kingdom wages war. <gasps> oh, this is 400 years ago. This is 600 AD. Our kingdom, with, yeah, with the fiend lord's army day and night, fighting to restore the realm's peace. Pray tell you knew that much, at least. Of course. Then might you show me the good grace to stop wandering about pestering folk with moronic questions? No, never. There, have you gone mad? This is no time for mirth and mummery. Oh, praise be, they found Queen Lean. Okay, Queen Lean. Lean was the name of Lean Square. Okay. They found Queen Lean wandering up in the canyon. She'd been missing for so long, I'd feared the worst. Okay. She must be back at the castle by now, getting some much needed rest. I think your hearts are a little more at ease now. When Queen Lean disappeared, it was all the king could think of. Wait, he thought if the fiend, he thought it the fiend lord's doing, and dispatched soldiers to the four corners of the realm to find her. She's been found, and that's all that matters. Okay, she's not missing. She's been found. The fiend lord's army laid waste to Zenon Bridge. We've lost our only road to the southern continent. Right. Okay. Um, can I? Talk to you. You're an outsider too? The name's Toma. I'm an explorer. And if you can spare 10G to buy this round, I'll be a storyteller. <gasps> Always trying to... That's fine. I can bite more mushrooms. Another mug. Oh, I'm talking to this guy. I thought I was talking to the bartender. Cheers, friend. Well, then a promise is a promise. It's about the missing... Wait, missing queen? I thought she wasn't missing anymore. My travels have taken me to the cathedral in the western wood, and there's something most peculiar about, peculiar about that place. Okay, cathedral in the western wood. It's only a hunch, but beg your pardon? They found Queen Lena in the canyon. Ah, huh, seems my, my suspicions were misplaced. How do I talk to this guy? If I wait till you get right in front of me, can I talk to you? Oh, you don't even come. <sighs> Excuse me, sir! Now. Okay, I don't think I can talk to him. He doesn't want to talk to me. He knows. He knows something. Okay, breaking into this house. You have purple hair. Millennial fair. Listen, Chrono, you already know. You already know, don't you? Have you been in your cups? Our king- what a delightful phrase. Our kingdom is only 600 years old. King Guardia the 21st still reigns, last I checked. All right, we did talk about the royalty when I was in the present in 1000 AD. I don't remember what number we, I, it doesn't matter though, I know where I am. I scarce remember the days before the war against the fiend lord began. The months turn to years, when will all this end? All right, so people are just telling me where I am. Oh, there's no Furby in, four, or in 600 AD. So, you've a mind to buy some weapons and join the fight against the Fiend Lord's army, have you? Wonderful! Okay. I don't have any money. But uh, I'm gonna look at your weapons. Oh, right, I'm only me. I don't have anyone with me. So, he probably can't use the pea shooter. I don't know who can. Yeah, I already have this stuff. So... I might buy a shelter, though. I feel like that could be good to have. For an emergency. My thanks. Do come again. We're not in question mark anymore. Oh, you're right. Oh, it just says Middle Ages, though. It doesn't give the actual year. Does it on the... No, it doesn't on the map, either. Oh, it does. 600 AD. Ooh, the bell. I'm Banta, the village blacksmith. I'm forging this bell at the king's behest as a symbol of his love for Queen Lean. The Queen's Vanishing Act had me wondering if all this work would be for naught. After all, what's the bell without the Queen? What's the bell? Wait. It seems I found her in the canyon up north. She's back at the castle now, and I'm back to work. 
My husband wants a daughter, both clever and fair. Oh. Okay. So this is... Wait. Was this here? On the other map? We pray for the peace of our world. We are ever so devout, tee hee hee. O oh, great Lord and Master, deliver your judgment upon the weak and undeserving, that we might reclaim the future for ourselves in your name. My name? Oh, how delicious. I mean, delightful. Oh, no. I should probably leave. Why not say a prayer for yourselves? They keep laughing. All right, we're gonna leave. All right, back into the forest we go. I would like to fight some enemies. All right, more goblins with their balls. Oh, they do tricks. Oh, they're, oh, there's two of them. Nope, they're one. Just subtle stuff. Cool. The beastie balls. Yeah. <laughs> 10 XP. What the heck is TP? Oh, is TP tech points that like it levels up my, my techs? Like when I get more... I bet that's what it is. When I get more points. TP needed... Yep, okay. That's exactly what it is. <gasps> Did that bird... Wait. Oh, I'm... I have the gray outline. Am I slow? I think I'm slow. Don't die on me, Chrono. Don't worry, I've got potions. <gasps> ding, ding, ding! I got it right! Okay, we got TP. 96G. It's like one, two, three. What would you do with 96G? I had to. All right. Halt! Who goes there? <gasps> the soldiers are eternal. They are the same soldiers. I've not seen your face before. In those outlandish clothes. Wouldn't you be one of the Fiend Lord's agents, would we? Ha! Fat chance. Look at him. That boy's not built to lift a sword. Excuse you, I have a bronze sword. Let alone serve in the Fiend Lord's army. Stop that at once. Woman's voice, okay. Queen Lean! <gasps> that man is my friend, and you will treat him as such. But your majesty, there's something strange about his look. You refuse to obey my orders? This is moral, right? No, I- forgive me, my lady. Please, enter. I mean- Oh, she told me to go that way I should pro- uh, Do I explore, or do I go? It's lean. Okay, clearly it's lean. There. Oh, I can just go downstairs and rest? I will- I will do that. Yes, I would like to rest. That is wonderful to know that I don't have to pay. Oh, there's a man sleeping next to me. Sir? Uh. Alright, he's good. Fiend Lord's troops are strangely quiet. Something must be afoot. Sanon Bridge is our last line of defense. It must hold, even should it mean our lives. You're the queen's friend, are you not? Talk to the maid if you need to rest. Okay, I've rested. Long ago, a vile beast named Yakra lurked in the western forest. I have a feeling I may need to fight this Yakra at some point. People were loath to wander near. But since the cathedral was built here. Wait, okay, wait. I don't think there's a cathedral in 1000 AD. So either it was, like, bulldozed or something changed in the timeline. And now there's no cathedral. It seems the place is truly blessed. Do you all say different things? Sir Cyrus was a commander of the Nightwood, sworn to protect the king and the queen with his own blade. Ten years ago, he and a lone fr fi friend, friend departed on a quest. 
and no one has heard from them since. Since That's why you don't do side quests. What a relief. Now that the queen's been found, we can refocus our... Okay, so she's been, she's been found because she's our friend who came here from the future. So is she the real her, or does she just look like her? Hmm. Maybe she didn't belong in our present. Yes, I've heard of him. Were he here, the whole, the whole affair with the queen's disappearance would never have happened. The dining hall is below. The master of kitchens has a foul temper. Best stay out of his way unless you fancy a tongue lashing. It's the real her? Uh, the real Queen Lean? Oh, is this guy drunk? Have you been in your cups? I'm dying. <laughs> I'm dying of hunger, oh no. There's food on the table. Your meal is ready. <gasps> um, finally. He just was hungry. I thought he was passed out drunk. He was just hungry. The master of kitchens has earned his post. His cooking is worthy of at least three stars. The fiend lord's troops had better watch out for us. This is making me hungry. I want a matcher of ki matcher a master of kitchens. Eat your fill before you. I want to eat. Okay, can you, hungry my lord, take a seat? at the upper left corner of the left table. Okay. Can I actually eat? I mean, there must be a way. There we go. What will you have? Ooh, spiced roast, please. Just a moment then. Here you go. Oh my gosh, that whole roast is for me? HP and, oh. Oh, so I can either rest or I can go get a roast. I wonder if I all do different things. Be mindful of your place. Jerk! I'm her friend! King Guardia the 21st sits in audience within. Ooh, who do you remind me of? Hmm. Okay, I guess that's the king. Queen's chambers are above. Wait, so the queen is my friend, but she's also Queen Lean. How old is she supposed to be? My, my age, right? Like 17? He looks like a stall. Yes, he does. The queen's... Okay, okay. I have permission. The king's chambers are on the top of the tower. The knight's quarters are downstairs. Oh, okay. Well, I've already done my exploring. Thank you. I am to understand that you played some role in helping to rescue my lady wife. Wife? How old is King? And I went on a date with her. However, I'm not sure yet if, like, they're just mistaking her for the queen, or if, like, she actually is the queen, somehow came to my time, and now took me back to hers. I'm not sure what's going on yet. I owe you a debt of gratitude. Might you know what befell Lean? She has been acting rather oddly since her return. The limes are already so strong. I might need to like, bring some limes. Like so, like a lime type of snack while I'm playing this. And she seems to have lost the coral hairpin she always wore. She always treasured that thing so. Forgive me, you must be tired. Hmm. Ooh, chili and lime chips. I'll speak to the commander. Okay, wait, uh... Knight's quarters down the stairs to the left. No, I'm, I'm good. We'll go find Lean. Wait, but she's Marl, right? Ooh, or popcorn. This is a very popcorn type of game, I think. Methinks. Chest. Ooh, another potion. There, yeah, okay. I w Huh. Oh no, this, and axes. I want an axe. They're giving me a lot of potions though. It's been over 10 years since her majesty first came to this castle, but she scarce aged a day. In fact, she looks even younger now than she did before her disappearance. Say that again? It's been over 10 years since her majesty first came to this castle, but she scarce aged a day. 
since Her Majesty first came to this castle. Has she been time traveling always? Like maybe this, maybe she's, hmm. Okay. So she came to the castle, married the king, then came to my timeline, and then back here. All right, all right, what's going on here? But she hasn't aged a day. She looks younger. So that makes me think it's not the real her. We'll see. I need to talk to her. In fact, she looks even younger. Yeah, okay. Younger now before her disappearance. You're the one who saved our queen? I'd expect- wait. Why do they think I saved her? I'd expected one a bit more dashing. How dare you. I am so dashing. Ha, huh, there you are. Please leave us. I need to have words with this man in private. As you wish, your majesty. All right, what's the deal? Come nearer, don't be shy. Oh, I'm suddenly reading her as very evil. <laughs> I don't, let me explore your room first. You've got a spindle too. Also, she just has a single bed. Why would the queen have her own room with a single bed? Told you, didn't I, Chrono? It's me, but everyone keeps calling me Lean for some reason. Okay, so she's not the real Lean. All right, they've mistaken her. I'm glad you came. We were only together for that short time at the fair, but somehow I knew you'd come for me. Thank you, Chrono. Wait. Uh, why is everything being poisoned? What's happening? We didn't change color, though. I feel... I feel like I'm being torn apart. Oh, no. <gasps> Help me, Chrono! I'm scared! It's like I'm dying. Please, Chrono, help! Oh no, she's- oh! Is she going back to the fair? Where is she? Ah! Oh no! Uh... Oh no, I didn't do it! They're all gonna think I did it! Oh no! Hey guys, everything's fine. By the way, did Her Majesty seem somehow not herself? No, of course not! Truly, perhaps I worry over much. Her Majesty has dismissed you already? No, uh... You didn't engage in any untoward behavior. Oh, she's not even there. Well, yes! <laughs> what happens if I say, well, yes? Of course not. Let us hope that is the case. Uh, a great number of things change as the years go by, but if there's one thing that will ever be the same, it's women and their insufferable love of gossip. Ugh. How exhausting your life must be. Ah, uh, Chrono, no, not me. <gasps> what, what? I just threw the controller. <laughs> oh, you're okay, did you find the girl? Ah. Uh, she what? Thank goodness I have a friend. She disappeared? Huh, it's just as I thought then. I knew I recognized her from somewhere. Is she lying? We seem to be in Guardia, but it looks a lot older than the Guardia we're from. They must have mistaken that girl- Okay, for her ancestor. Okay. After all, that girl was our princess, Nadia. Nadia! Her name's Nadia! Marl, that is Princess Nadia, is a descendant of Queen Lean. Uh... What? The... <laughs> The age of man. Uh, okay, wait, okay, wait. Oh, never mind. it's trying to tell me something. Queen Lean was kidnapped. Someone was supposed to have gone and saved her, but now history has been changed. 
Oh! Alright, so Lean is kidnapped. That guy they were talking about, Sir Cyrus, was supposed to save her. But for some reason he doesn't, so I bet we have to go find Cyrus. Or something. Marl looks so much like the Queen that they probably called off the, their search. Oh! They called off the search. That's why. That's why. If the real Queen is killed. So there is still a Queen that's missing. Poor real lean, I know. Mar will never have existed, but there might still be enough time. If we can save the queen, history as we know it should remain unchanged. I love this. Ah, exactly, Chrono. Chrono is me. <laughs> something must happen to the queen in this era if she isn't rescued. And if something happens to her, her descendant, Princess Nadia, will never come into being. We have to find the real queen! Okay, uh, the real queen. But we also have to find Nadia. Or are we assuming she just went back? I guess that's the goal. We messed everything up. And now we need to put it back. 